Yeah, let's go, Misery! <laughs> let's go, girl! Show us what you got, man! Ooh. Hello to the Marathon Demon Slayer Sunday! Woo! And oh my god, guys, we are literally down to the final two episodes of Demon Slayer Peak, man. Like, dude, guys, time flew by so quickly, man. It was just like yesterday we watched the very first episode of season three. That was just a one year away, but now here we are, guys, the second last episode of the season. Usually the second last episode of any Demon Slayer episode, or usually the best episode, especially what you can see from the second season, man. Like, where, you know, Gyotaro versus Tengen, that scene itself was literally peak, man. Man. And now from the second last episode, from what I can see from the preview images, I'm expecting some great fight scene because Mitsuri finally joins the fight, man. Like, oh my god, dude, guys, we've been waiting for Mitsuri greatness, man. And we are here for some greatness between Mitsuri against the hatred. Well, you know, Kantengu in this case. So yeah, looking forward to it. But of course, Muichiro does his part to defeat Gyotaro, but literally one of the most easiest way to finish off him off. That wasn't really much. A lot I see a lot of people complaining, but you can definitely tell that Muichiro is really strong. So hopefully he has a chance against one of the top three upper moons. But oh Oh my god man this episode is mid three time man oh i just can't wait because i'm pretty sure we're gonna have, gonna have a backstory too along the way but i'm here for some mid three greatness man so with that said let's get started with the second last episode of demons their greatness shall we come on misery do your thing man with your brute strength your whip like sword oh, oh man what a reaction <laughs> Man, mystery, man. She's such a character, I would say. This is why she's the favorite. Hey, Mitsuri, focus on your job, man. He's coming after you now. Come on, focus, focus, girl. Yeah, oh my god. Oh, shit. Son of what now? Oh, <laughs> oh, shit. Damn. What a whip like attack. I know, right? The katana is uh, literally a whip. Allow her to like literally play around with it, like you know the gymnastic dancing, gymnastics of style. She's flexible enough to use it, so good enough for her, I guess. Oh yo, look at her go, man! She's just dancing, man. She's Ino Kata. Let's go! Oh my god, bro, dude, Mitsuri, man, she's too good. Oh shit, oh, multiple dragon head attack. <laughs> oh my god, dude, she's panicking right now, man. Holy cow. Yeah, your turn, Tanjiro, get to it while, you know, she's taking care of the dragon head, man. Dude, look at this, man. Look at her running, man. Like, holy shit. Dude, this scene kind of reminds me of the Saber, the uh, Saber Ultra versus Rider scene, man. Oh, 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 oh shit, bro. Damn, misery, man. Look at her go, man. Oh, yes! Let's go! Let's go! Come on! Come on! Finish it! Oh, oh shit. Oh, of course, Sonic Sound. I totally forgot about that. Oh, no. Oh! Oh, yeah, that's true. It's just a clone, though. Oh, no. Oh! Oh, no! Oh, shit! That's Super Sound! Oh, my God! Fuck! Wait, what? No way. She stood ground? No way, she actually stood her ground. Oh no, she's knocked out. Fuck, she's knocked out. Yeah, I know, she able to stand her ground, but she's knocked out, so she's vulnerable right now, okay? Anyone, Tanjiro, anyone, jump in right now. Oh, uh, fuck. Fuck, Tanjiro, Nezuko, Genya, anytime now. She's not moving. And, of course, you have to jump right into the backstory. Of course, you have to do something like this, man. <laughs> I mean, why not, I guess. Okay, now that's harsh, just harsh, man. What? Oh, so her backstory is that she's been rejected by guys, I guess, for marriage. Seriously, man? Her hair looks nice. What's, what's wrong with her hair? This guy's an issue. Whoa. Whoa. So, guess when she was small, she's actually already strong. Damn. So she's like one of those like physically different girls in, at birth. And of course, with a lot of muscle density in her body, she eats a lot. Of course, man. Of course. I mean, muscle needs energy food to replenish it. So yeah, she eats a lot. Yeah, she can she can beat them, man. <laughs> a good dude, she can beat them. Oi! Holy cow, one go, man. In one go. Dude, how does she get those density in her body, man? Like, what kind of birth does this, what kind of genetics these parents have? 
Yeah, you know, when girls reach this maturity stage, they start to be more aware of their feminine side. So I can understand where Mystery is coming with this. Seriously, you have to dye your hair just to fit in? Oh man, I mean, she still, she still looks fine black hair too, but... Yeah, you can definitely tell that she just wanted to be pretty, be accepted. Yes. Finally, she's more aware of her own good attributes, man. Don't have to force yourself to be someone different. Just be yourself, and someone will eventually choose you for who you are. So, yeah, I guess this is a life lesson for everyone. Just be who you are, man. Oh, hey, back to reality. Hey, so she's got saved. Nice, nice. Good stuff, good stuff. Yeah, yeah, of course. He's the only hope you guys have to face against him. So, very safe, very safer. <laughs> Hey, they're carrying her. Cool. Oh, shit. What a lightning strike. <laughs> what? She deflected it with her sword. Like, damn. Let's go, Mitsuri. Back in action time. <laughs> look at his face. Oh, my God. Look at Nesuko's face. Like, oh, my God. Senpai. <laughs> oh, my God. Mitsuri, man. Such a character she is. Oh, finally, you're going to get serious. Let's go. Come on. So, it seems like she has chosen to become a Hashira to use her strength for good. Good, good choice. Good life choice right there, Misery. Well, I gotta say, man, such a touching story, man. Misery finally found her purpose in life. Just go and fight for good and save society from demons with her, you know, insane strength. <laughs> Aww. You definitely know that he has a crush on her, man. Like, you know, he's trying to, like... Be uh, nice to her. <laughs> With a, so I guess where that's where she got her socks. I'm actually really curious to what his, you know, br well, breathing techniques like. Is it snake breathing and something like that? Yeah, let's go, Mystery! Yes! Let's go, girl! Show us what you got, man! Who? Yes! So Mystery is gonna deal with the dragons while they go and look for the main body. Yep. Oh my god, yes, come on, Misery. Buy time for them, man. Yo, is she gonna activate her Demon Slayer mark? Holy shit, yo, oh, damn. That, that dynamics in the animation, man. Like, holy shit. Oh, oh, yes, in time, man. She gone faster, man. Holy cow, yo, look at her, man. Look at her, look at that body of hers, man. Holy cow. Yo, look at Misery, man. Dude, she's literally carrying this fight. Like, oh my god. This is a Hashira, man. She oh my god, dude. She's so good. Oh, oh my god. She activated her mark already. Yes, let's go. Come on, let's go. Oh, hey. Man, that was a clean, clean slash right there, man. Oh my god, dude. He's getting hesitant right now. He's stressed, man. This guy is stressed out. So yeah, guys, make this count, man. Mystery is taking all the blows right now for you guys to find the main body. So hurry up with this. Wait, what? What did he do? Oh, okay. Whoa. Whoa, is he actually using his teeth? Wait, is he actually swallowing it? What, what the fuck, man? Oh, God. It's disgusting, but well, at least that's how his body works. Using the demon part to revitalize his body because he's a demon too. Yeah, with the jaws, man. Holy cow. Now hurry up before he escapes. Oh, yes. Let's go burn it down, baby. Yes. Burn, baby. Oh, my God. Hurry, Tanjiro. What are you doing there? Hurry. Yes. That's more like it. Hino Gami Kagura. Embu. Oh, nice. Oh, come on. Oh, what? He's gone? Oh, of course he's gone. He escaped in time. Ah, uh, he's over there, man. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Why are you using Talk No Juicy right now? Hurry, run after him already. Oh my god. Henteku got his backstory while Gyoko got nothing last week. Um, yeah, of course. The four, oh, anything higher than the five, you always get a backstory, huh? <laughs> um, guys, why are you standing there, man? Hurry, man. What game, what are you doing? Oh, he's going through the tree, isn't he? Yep. Yeah, show him your demon strength, man. Throw it, javelin, throw it. Yes, come on, land on him. Oh, nice. Nezuko, your turn. Finish it. Oh, oh, what? 
fucking oh the hell what no why again oh my god seriously these cliffhangers are killing me softly man oh my god jesus christ man like bro nezuko was about to deliver the finishing blow and it ended there for the finale next week which i will not be able to react in this room i'll be reacting in the usa hotel room so hopefully i'm able to do so because i don't know how the time works in usa so oh my god yeah i gotta say man this cliffhanger is brutal again but well, like I said, they had to find ways to get you excited for the finale, which is going to be an hour special. Basically, they try to fit everything to end this arc. So I'm looking forward to see how they end the arc. So yeah, I gotta say, man, looking forward to see what the final scene will be like next week. And hopefully, hopefully they announce a season four or basically a season four PV or whatever, because it's basically been rumored that season four is in production right now so if it says so it's in production then i'm presuming next week we'll get some news regarding to it so yeah looking forward to it indeed but my god man this episode was all about mystery i mean hence the title for today's episode is mystery well i mean her backstory is literally i mean at least her parents are very loving very caring and very you know understanding of her situation so they willing to support her so that is good signs of good parenting but yeah, I gotta say, man, now we kind of understand why she's so desperate to find, well, a lover, a boyfriend, a fiancé. Because, well, when she was around her young teenager years, she got rejected because of her, well, muscle density and her hair and her, well, apparently, um, she's not too feminine. I mean, I don't know where the guys are looking at, but... Yeah, I gotta say, man, so mystery backstory is more so regarding to her muscle density because, you know, she doesn't really been to be like a girl because of her well not so feminine like but hey she's beautiful okay she's beautiful amongst the girls of this is well of course number one is nezuko number two is uh, you know shinobu number three is mystery sorry about this guy but shinobu i like her better in terms of her physique design her character uh, design so well i gotta say man mystery man she really really enjoy her backstory in terms of how supportive she is and you know how she willing to use her you know Phys physical genetic uh, prowess to for the better society so in the so this is a life lesson for you guys Do, don't always you know change yourself always just be yourself because if you be yourself one day there will be people that's you know willing to you know like you who you are no, don't always be someone that may force people to like who you do not who you are i mean i don't know how that works but yeah let's just say mystery backstory is a basically a life lesson so yeah, very touching indeed, man. Well, I gotta say, man, today's animation, the affordable once again imp impresses us again with some uh, incredible dynamic animation. Some, dude, some of the animation for today's episode really reminds me of the fate fight between Saber Alter and, you know, um, what is it again, Ryder. I mean, yeah, I mean, there was some scene that resembles it. So yeah, the affordable goes to show that, you know, they put so much love for the animation. Do you really see the love and passion of the sound effects too? And of course, the for the shadowing of the colors of the you know when he up close to Hanten Gu and stuff like that so yeah I gotta say man it's such incredible work by Ufotable as always I mean I said this for for the past like 10 episodes already so I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys will be you know having enough of me hearing this already but hey guys look at this episode just look at this episode just dude this animation progress of how the slash effect the sound effect and of course how mystery move around those dragons dude come on it takes a lot of good animation moment uh no time to work on it and they did a fantastic job with it so you thought about once again you did an amazing job although i just said the intro that you know the second last episode of the season tends to be the most exciting of the season well compared to this second last episode to the season two it's not that exciting. I mean, of course, Mystery got her moment, but it's more like, you know, she's just trying to get to him rather than, you know, direct confrontation. So, well, I mean, of course, everyone will... I can, I can somehow see on Twitter, a lot of people start comparing season two, second last episode to this, where the second last episode last season was so epic, man. Like, you know, Tengen versus Gyotaro, like that clash scene, that was literally what got people off the seat. But this one, though... Yeah, basically people just mesmerized by mystery, amazing um, gymnastic acrobatic skills. So, 
I mean, of course, a lot of people weren't too happy with how season three pans out. But hey, I've, this is how, I've, from what I've been told from manga reader, this is how the story, you know, flows. So you thought it was doing a good job adapting every panel as much as possible and adding some extra values to it with some of the crazy moments of the animation. So they did a good job already. So if you want to blame someone, blame the author for, I don't know, didn't, don't give us something that we saw from last season. But I think the, I think next the next arc or the arc two will wear fans are more excited about so a lot of people are excited for this season to end already and get on with season four already because the next arc people are more hyped for that so yeah I'm gonna say man looking forward to the final episode and see how they end the season and see how it transitioned to the next season and looking forward to see how they defeat guild um you no know, hunting group once and for all too so with that said hope you guys enjoy my reaction for today smash the love button and i'll see you guys next week for the finale but i will not be reacting here i'll be reacting in the usa so i'll see you guys then for it